Hi, welcome to New York State Parks. My name is Liz, and today we will explore the interesting and unique characteristics of the Eastern Painted Turtle. If you have visited a New York State Park recently and seen a turtle with red and yellow stripes on its back, neck, or tail, you have most likely seen an Eastern Painted Turtle. This is one of the most common turtle species in the state of New York. The top part of the turtle shell is called the carapace. It's the hard shell that protects the turtle inside. The bottom portion of the shell is called the plastron. Because turtles are cold-blooded reptiles, they rely on the sun's warmth to keep their internal body temperature normal. To do this, they climb onto logs, onto shore, usually in groups, to bask in the sun. After their temperature is maintained to normal, they return back to the water to forage. Typically, these turtles eat insects, earthworms, leeches, and some plants, including duckweed and algae. One interesting fact about this turtle that you may not be aware of is that they actually hibernate during the winter months by going underwater up to seven feet deep and burying themselves. They can stay there for months at a time, usually from October to March. During the hibernation period, the turtles don't actually breathe, but if the surroundings allow, they do absorb some oxygen from the environment into their skin. This species is one of the most well-studied vertebrates that can go long periods of time without oxygen. The next time you are in a New York State Park, keep an eye out for the Eastern Painted Turtle, as well as many other interesting species. For more information, visit nysparks.com. Thank you.